hi, Graham Vincent, musician, violin maker here. Uh, yeah, Monday's the 6th of February today, uh, so I'm back in the workshop again. It was, um, I think it was minus two degrees centigrade um, this morning, first thing. Uh, it's supposed to be going up to about eight, the highest temperature today, so could be worse. Uh, anyway, you've got the wood-burning stove on, you can probably hear the crackling in the background. Uh, the three violins are progressing. I didn't manage to get in here over the weekend, uh, so this is where I got to last thing on Friday. Um, fundamentally, all three are at the stage where uh, I have got the, um, the middle ribs in place. Um, so I'm carrying on with that today. Um, my plan is basically to get um, the top ribs glued in on all of them. Uh, and we'll see how much further than that we can get. Well, Tuesday evening, just about to go in. So I've got all the ribs on. So this is the bird's eye maple one. That's the the ash one, obviously. Uh, and that's the pear one. So coming on pretty quickly. I've been working flat out, non-stop, no mucking about. Um, obviously the next stage is to um, put some linings in. Uh, musician. It's uh, Tuesday the 7th of February. Uh, it's cold, got the heater back on again. Um, haven't, got, uh, haven't got that many off cuts left at the moment to run the fire, so um, I'll have a look at that. Uh, get some more wood in, I think. I think the first thing to do is have a bit of a workshop tidy today, so I'm gonna do that. And then it's, um, I've got other things that I need to do this afternoon, unfortunately, I'm actually, <laughs> For my sins, I'm volunteering for three hours in the village shop, um, which is a sort of uh, something 
we all like to do in the village. It's a, a community land trust and um, basically it's, it's run by the community, which is great. So the plus side of that is we get a shop and a bit of community and get to sort of see all the other villagers, which is great for someone who works on his own. Anyway, I'm waffling, going off on a tangent. Um, so today's plan is um, to... I've got, enough, I've got enough time to actually sort of put the linings in on one side of all of these three, I think. So that's what I'm going to try to do today. Uh, I think what's described as yellow pine um, from a 150 year old uh, chest of drawers. And that's easy. I'm just springing the linings into place and then letting them letting them cool in shape. So the way I do linings is basically steam them. That's both sides of the uh, of the linings in on all three. Probably my least favourite part of violin making, linings, and to probably one of my favourites. So um, on with making the scrolls, uh, carving. I love carving. I love carving the archings. I love carving the scrolls. Also, great. <laughs> Friday the 10th of February, another frosty morning, so off to work. <laughs> I'm gonna have to buy some new matches.
Wow, five hours later. Amazing. Isn't that gorgeous? So there it is, end of the first week really, um, all the fronts and backs jointed up, thickness down to the 12 mil that I like to sort of start um, my work on the actual sort of arching from, linings, in, blocks in, linings in, the rib garland all done and the um, necks sort of roughed out, although I haven't really started carving on the scrolls yet, so a little more than blanks really. So that's that's the ash one obviously then we've got the maple one and the pear one with the second one egg busy week i think i'm gonna uh call it a day there um i probably won't be working in here at the weekend i'm off to have a curry now i'm really looking forward to that anyway so signing off see you soon folks cheers bye